Yo, what's happening? See, some people are scared of first dates and others are intimidated by fine dining. But now this player, that's not how I roll. Just watch this. Let's do this. <laughs> do you mind? One of the first ways of impressing a woman on a date is with a knowledge of fine wine. I always run a try before you buy policy. Have a dig at this. Well, that was a laugh, but uh, I'll have a pint of lager, and I'll tell you what, just get her a glass of house wine. It's small. Cheers, John. At some point in the evening, the waiter is going to question your manliness. I mean, he's got the umpty, he's doing a woman's job, and you're out with a sweet little piece of ass like this. So he'll probably turn around and say something like, oh, the plate's too hot for you. Yeah? Well, I'll be the judge of that. Now, if you get served the kind of swill only set for a pig, it's your job as a man in the relationship to complain about this. Now, some people worry about complaining. Me, I'll just throw my cards on the table. I tell them... Anything all right with your meal, sir? Lovely. Beautiful. Just, yeah, compliments to the chef on that one, mate. Cheers. Thank you. <laughs> Oi, Chelsea, mate. They're going to win the league this season, you nut. <laughs> Make sure the little lady knows that she is the centre of your universe. Make the conversation about her. Try and be a little bit sensitive and metrosexual. So, um, periods, how are they working out for you? Dating's own ground zero happens when the little mouse you've taken out turns out to be an absolute elephant. Getting ideas above her station, taking food off your plate, not a mob. Oi, 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 oi. Hey, you wanted the steak, you should have ordered the steak. Seriously, love. Well, that's the thing about dating. Some of them go good, and some of them go great. Ching, ching. <laughs>